I'm here with Jordan Baldwin, who read the book The Monster. Jordan, can you tell me what was the theme of the book The Monster? The theme of the book was courage, because he was sent to prison for basically a crime he did not commit. And, and oh, and he could have been sent to pr sent prison for life, but he had a trial, and he showed courage to do to say things in his trial. Um, what was the most courageous thing he did? When he testified. Um, what was the summary of the book, The Monster? So, he gets sent to prison because he's suspected for a murder of a drugstore owner. And he basically, in like the first kind of half, went, just writes in his journal. Then there was a trial. Things were kind of looking bad for him. Then, when his, when his part of the trial begins, like the defense, he testifies, and that was basically the main part of why he was not sent to prison. Okay. Um, have you read any books or movies that are kind of similar to The Monster? Well, if you're talking about movies, there's this movie that I had to watch with my mom, and it was called The Help. And you have these African-American maids in the 60s and this lady had a, was writing a book on how these maids were treated and the maids had to show courage like Steve did to basically just stand up and basically say stuff. Okay. Yeah. Um, there were some important events in the book. In the beginning of the book could you tell me some of the things that was going on? In the beginning of the book he sent to prison and he basically writes how bad prison is. And in the middle, towards the end, what was happening? In the middle, that's kind of getting towards the end, is the trial, mostly the prosecution. And then towards the end is a defense testified, and he's sent out of prison. Okay. Um, what were the characters in this book? There's him. Steve, basically, who is the main character. You have Bobo, and then I don't remember the last one. Is. There's a third character. And I just can't remember what the third character's name was. I okay. A long time. Um, for the character Steve, can you tell me what he was like? So basically, Steve's 16. He's African American. He lives in New York. Um. He's kind and basically nice to everybody. And uh, he also likes movies. I don't, I'm always wanted to be a, like a writer or a movie maker. Is there um, anything can you identify with Steve? Or what, what do you find that you find interested about you and Steve? Anything, any connections? Um, I like watching movies. And he likes making movies, so basically movies kind of ties together. Okay. Um, what do you think the title The Monster means? I think the title The Monster is probably the, like, the monster that was inside him. And that was, could have been inside him. And that's probably, probably what other people thought was, was inside him. And what ended up, was he a monster for killing him? Actually, he didn't kill him, and he's not a monster. He's actually pretty nice. Okay. Um, lastly, what part was the most important part of the book, and why? The most important, the, the, the most important book. Part, part. Most important part. I'm sorry, this is kind of late. Sorry about this. The most important part is when he testifies. If he didn't testify, he'd probably be in prison and would probably be on death row and basically life in prison. Um, would you recommend this book? It kind of depends, like like many other books, like the type of um, of genre it is. So, like, if I wanted to read a book, like, I would find books about sports easier than about, like, drama. So, Out of five stars, what would you give this book? Maybe a four. All right. Yeah.
So this is my interview with Jordan Baldwin and the book The Monster. <laughs> 